Hello good people of YouTube, I'm Brian Summerfield, welcome back to the channel. So I am actually here in my workshop. I have a whole bunch of gear all over the place and I thought I'd give you an update on what I've been up to lately. So I apologise I haven't been uploading a lot of content as of late, but I have been a busy boy. So currently we're working on an OB trailer which is going to be a lot of fun to build actually. So we've gone through, worked with the client, we've got a design down, we've figured out all the equipment. Uh, so a lot of the equipment is actually behind me. So that's everything that has been ordered. So a lot of the equipment's already here. The trailer itself has been custom built and it is currently on its way to Australia for us to fit out. So that will be happening in the next uh, two weeks or so, which is exciting. So we'll definitely be showing you that and giving you a bit of a reaction tour of once it's actually here and some of the plans of what we are going to do with it. But the first thing that we uh, started to work on was actually all of our stage racks. So our plan with the trailer was to have a, obviously the trailer itself, which is where most of the operations would have happen, and then have a bunch of stage boxes where you can um, drop on your set, on your, uh, in your studio, where you can plug in your cameras, plug in your audio, your comms, networking, KVMs, whatever you like. So we've got three different uh, size stage boxes, which we're making all of them running fiber and I thought I'll give you a quick uh, overview over what we're making. Um, so we're currently on holidays at the moment, but we are mid, mid build at the moment and this is what we have come up with so far. So here are the, here are the racks. Obviously they are in the middle of the build at the moment. So we have a big rack down here, which contains um, UPS. It's going to be an audio stage box for Alan Heath. Uh, here's our main pat panel for the video is coming in and out from the camera. We're using um, redundant network switches. So we've got 10 gig pipes going between the, um, the trailer and the switch. So all the networking goes in here. And it's all coming over this awesome multi-fiber. So it's a MTP connector. Uh, so this is a waterproof one from fs.com. Um, so we're using these to run 12 fibers between the uh, studio, uh, between the studio set and the trailer itself. Um, give you an idea of a little bit of the insides. We've got the Blackmagic optical fiber 12G converters. So we're running everything in 6G for this trailer. So we've got 6G converters everywhere. Um, so we'll be able to run five cameras into each of these boxes. So the idea being that we're running Ursa Mini Pros and the Ursa range of cameras. So we have uh, uh, SDI going in we have SDI coming out with program return, which is what we've got the DA for back there. And so we've got eight of them. And then we also have a power supply, which means that we can run all of these cables and all these cameras over a single loom. So we have banged up a bunch of looms. So we'll have two SDI and one power. So all you need is a single loom, go click, click, click into the back of the camera and you are good to go. Uh, all these are UPS obviously to keep things going in case of a uh, power failure. Um, so yeah, here is our um, MTP connector, obviously mid-build mid at the moment. But yeah, so these are all going to here. Um, there will be another set of uh, network switches in here as well. Um, and running everything on redundant power supplies. So rather than having a whole bunch of little power adapters, running 12 power supplies for here. And I've also got our power supplies for the cameras themselves as well. So... That's what's going on here. Obviously we have cooling fans and everything to keep everything nice and cool while we're working. Here is the uh, the big one we're working on. This one is mostly done at the moment, which is fin fun. Uh, we have a whole bunch of Sennheiser G4 um, audio for in and outs. We have uh, cooling fans in here and everything's all tucked up nicely and neatly inside there. We have my cat Taz, who is uh, quite a cutie. So this is the big one. Coming over here, we have our little guy. So this is just a little box just with five cameras in and out, as well as a 10 gig and a uh, one gig PoE adapter as well, just for a quick stage box drop. So obviously all this is still very much a work in progress, um, keeping things neat, obviously, as much as we can. Um, but I'll give you a couple of ideas of what's coming up. So we've got a whole bunch of different gear, cables for days, everything's been custom made to length. Here is the... Uh, one of the multi-fibers, so this is how we are getting um, the fiber to the stage box and to the trailer. So we got a whole bunch of different lengths. We got 30 meters, 100 meters, 
and even 300 meters. So we've got a whole bunch of different lengths depending on the needs. We have UPSs for days, uh, which will be going into the trailer itself. We've got a bunch of our bird dog um, 4K quads for NDI conversion. Um, got the uh, 8K uh, quad SDI in and outs for, for Blackmagic in a Thunderbolt box. A whole bunch of stranger decks because you can never have enough of them. Uh, this is gonna be, everything's gonna be running on Dante for audio. So we have a whole bunch of um, Dante converters, USB converters, and a whole bunch of Blackmagic gear. So we're running this on a Constellation 8K as a main switcher. Uh, so we have a whole bunch of um, Hyperdex, CCU, uh, Gringo is going to be our wireless and comm system of choice. So running a whole bunch of Gringo. Uh, we've got a live view box as well for uh, our main outputs, which is going to be exciting. Uh, also got adder boxes for um, our KVM system. So obviously it's a very brief overview of what we're doing, but hopefully get you excited and into what is to come. So obviously I'm not going to give away all our, all our little secrets because, um, you know, we worked hard to, <laughs> to get this far, but you know, I thought I'd take you along the journey because I enjoy doing this and I hope you enjoy watching this kind of content and you know, it's a bit more run and gun, but in the end, we'll see what happens. This is going to be a, you know, a decent length build, maybe another month or two before we get everything up and running, but we, are getting there. Things are happening. We've got all our uh, converters and um, connectors all racked up, ready, and all nice. So keep your things super clean. So hope you enjoyed. A little bit of a different one this time, but once we get the trailer in, we'll be going in there and checking it out and showing you guys in terms of what we have coming up and some of the plans we have into how to build this thing. So again, this is a very rough overview um, in terms of what we're building, but Hopefully, it'll get you excited and to what's to come. So more details to come, and I'll see you then. Thanks so much.